I need to go. Gilbert Q. Stepford is in the cash. How are you? My name is Gilbert Q. Step. I'm originally from the Yelko First Nation, but I currently reside in the city of Saskatoon now. My name is Judy Pelly. I'm a cultural advisor, knowledge keeper, in Sas primarily in Saskatoon. I, 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 I'm an Anishinaabe. I was born and raised in Cody First Nation with uh, grandfathers, and I grew up with ceremony. Orange Shirt Day is a movement of Indian residential, residential school survivors who went through a dark time in Canada's history. We all have committed that no child will go through life as we did as children. All children, lives matter. This Orange Shirt Day recognition began in 1973 when a six-year-old girl whose name was Phyllis Jack Webstead was stripped of her new orange shirt that her her grandmother had bought her for her first day of attending a residential school. This shirt was stripped of her and was never returned to her. Many of us that went to these schools felt like she did, where no one heard the cries of a child that no one cared to listen to. Orange Shirt Day means that we have overcome all the bad things that were done to us as children. Orange Shirt Day means that the prayers of our old ones helped a young boy begin a healing journey of hope. Orange Shirt Day means that I have been blessed to see the day that my grand that my children, my grandchildren, and great-grandchildren will never be left behind as we were. Orange Shirt Day means I am able to live the life my ancestors prayed for me to live with the guidance of our Creator and that I will walk with you. My commitment to Phyllis Jack Webstad and all our residential school survivors and their families is that, I, is that I will lift my grandfather early in the morning on this day and I will pray for the human spirit of all nations on this day for the betterment of all. This is my obligation to the human spirit as I wear this orange shirt on this day. This is our orange shirt day. May Creator bless us all. Hey, hey. Acknowledge the young, the young girl that was a six-year-old girl that was uh, went to school. I think it was 1973. She she went to a mission school in BC and was so anxious to go there with her, with her uh, orange shirt, shiny orange shirt that she just loved. Her and her uh, grandmother, uh, her grandmother had bought her this. And she was so excited to, to do that. And once she entered that school with her grandmother, she was stripped of that shirt uh, by the by the mis missionaries, I guess, guess, who were in that school, and and uh, never to see her orange shirt again. And imagine the heartbreak and the, uh, this little girl went through, uh, the heartbreak and of, of all of a sudden she was so happy and proud and then to be stripped of that, the, the uh, and the, the what it did to her 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 soul and her her uh, you know that happiness broken hearted she she went into that school and this this is uh, orange shirt day reminds us that there was many stu many many little kids that went to school at six or seven or eight whatever age and that that uh, went there with hope and 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 were what happened to them once they they crossed that door. And it brings into mind what's happening now in, in, in society where, where uh, people are now just learning that dark history after TRC. They're learning the, the, the dark history that uh, should have been taught in schools and never was. And I think that it's very important to in, uh, on this day to remember that, that these things happened and that they need to be taught. Uh, a lot of these uh, uh, 
our students and our newcomers, our uh, settler friends are just now learning. And I, and I encourage that. Uh, because we can only make a better tomorrow if we acknowledge that and we understand why some of the disparities are happening in our communities. And with that, uh, on, on, on Orange Shirt Day, I, commit, I will commit myself to, to be uh, there when the grandfathers are lifted, to be sitting there in, in ceremony and also to, uh, to do smudging and pray, praying for, for, the, for the people that have gone before us and, are, that, and to pray for the people in people uh, that are with us and, and in the future, our grandchildren and those yet unborn, to understand and to make it a better tomorrow. Understanding this history is very important and, and, and wearing those orange shirts has a very strong meaning in working together in our communities. Thank you very much. Miigwech.